Just another job that should have been done for us, but there you go. To that, um, to that Pro problems there. on site as always. That's it, I blame <laughs> <Airedale>. <laughs> <laughs> Just uh, over in Pontefract here, start a new job at a site for Jewel UK. About 180 metres and a few double gates and a couple of singles. I'll just turn it round so you can see. We're basically following the curb all the way along here. I'm following it round. It sort of goes round there. The single gate to go in there. And then we're basically following it all the way down here. There's some big double gates down at the bottom there. My guy's just getting set up. We just had the client out confirming where fence line is. And then we've a bit more to go over there with some double gates and single. And then we've got some automated barriers that Coastal Engineering's doing there and there. So my guys will get set up. We get a time lapse of them actually installing it. Keep you updated. My guy's just turning up here, look. How's it going, Baggy? Good. Are you winning? Yeah. Good lad. So Chris, what are we actually installing here today on site? So, we're installing, um, there's an 8 metre traffic barrier going here. Yep. Um, it's, uh, it's a brushless 36 volt bionic 8 uh, from RT Automation. So quite a big one, just a single barrier? Yeah, it's a single barrier, uh, it's going to have a support wipe boat at that side and uh, LED lights on the boom. Right, very good. Uh, controlled by remote controls um, in and out and there's going to be a safety loop cutting to the floor and then we've got a double one over the road have we and then just over the road over there we've got um, over there. a double double, double, it, yeah. double traffic barrier system um, again controlled by remote controls LED lights on top um, all singing all dancing that's it yeah all singing all dancing <laughs> Roger Good stuff, Roger. Tend to use that a lot now, you guys, don't you? I've noticed. It's all we use. Yeah. Why, why is that then? Just less breakdown stuff like that? We, well, we don't get any breakdowns. Right. Unless it's vandalism. Tell the difference, can't you? Yeah, that's solid, yep. Yeah. Just tell the difference in and quality. Believe it or not, when, when, they, when they are running, they are silent. Right. Well, that's what you want. Especially if you sat in this. So, we know what we're doing then, Chris. We're probably going to have a trench across this time. Yeah, we're here. all sort of going to... Obviously, trench across the LA duct um, to get another electrical cable. Which is another job that should have been done for us, but there you go. To that, um, to that Pro there. Problems on site as always. That's it, I blame <laughs> Airedale. <laughs> I, well, thanks for that, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I have tried, I have told them about four times, but no, I'm only joking. Um, even now he says, yeah, I'll have to get that okay. So I think, you know. Yeah. But at least the cracking on these these will be in pretty quickly, these I would have thought. And we'll uh, we'll keep you updated.
morning here we are again at site over in Pontefract for Jewel UK uh, my lads have been cracking on in fact they found it really bad digging it's like granite but we've got um, crucial engineering here on site look as you can see my guys have cracked on here down this run I think there's about 180 meters in total they've still got to come along along this line here and go across there with a little single gate there somewhere but this I mean light here has been installed so close to the curve we've literally had to bend the panel to get round it <coughs> I haven't been thought out right cracking but there you go yeah it's just our 2.4 V meshes this bit of standard stuff just to keep majority of people out but looking good fairly flat along here and then obviously where it goes down here they've had to step it down slightly Travis Perkins here look I think the digging's been an absolute nightmare for them been uh, like granite up against this kerb you can see big big pile there that they've had out of holes so that doesn't look good good material to be digging through even our big breakers have been struggling they said but one way or another we get through it I've had some easier jobs lately so swings and roundabouts so but yeah so they've just got a little bit more to do along here then we're going to go along here and we've got gates going across this this bit here, double gates and then just returning to there as you can see here, this job at Jewel is now finished we've come all the way up there and we've come along here with a nice double leaf gates to open outwards because of the slope we've just modified it a little bit on the bottom of this gate here so there's not a massive gap that people can get under there's nothing major here to steal it's more of a car park during day anyway and obviously we've just finished it off to the existing there nice job overall you can see our finished fence in here also got nice access gate and getting the car park here we fenced it all along there and we've literally gone all the way down there with some big double gates down the bottom as you can see they've installed the double barriers here pretty good and we've uh, been this morning installed this cable here crucial have been and done this trenching out here and then just ready to commission up this morning handover final handover show them how, how the client how it works <laughs> 